Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Open More Toys. Today on OMT we have a third Five Nights at Freddy's surprise egg. We have Foxy. And our Foxy giant Play-Doh surprise egg is 100% made out of Play-Doh. And he turned out great. I really like all the details. I even gave him the eye patch. So this giant Play-Doh surprise egg is full of awesome toy surprises. But we also have our final Five Nights at Freddy action figure to open up too. So this is kind of like a two-in-one because since this is our final toy, since we got all the other ones, we got all the pieces to make the bonus figure. We can make Springtrap. So I did three giant Play-Doh surprise eggs in a row. We're going to go ahead and open this guy up. I can't wait to check this one out. While we're opening him up, hey, what are you guys going to be for Halloween? Uh, this year I might be Batman, but we'll see. Let's see, so let's open this up. Look at Foxy, he looks really cool. They got put a lot of detail in him. I like all his like little metal hooks in his hand here. Whoops, that is pretty easy to come out. So make sure not to lose any parts of Foxy here because that hand seems to come out pretty easily. All right, so we have our Foxy and we got the final build or say the body part of the spring trap. So we got the arms and legs, one of each, and all the other figures last time. So here he is. Here's the body of Spring Chat. And he looks a really torn apart. He's missing an ear. He's missing tons of his fluffy fur. All right, so we can put on all these other parts. Let's start with the legs. All right, we have his legs on, and then we have the arms. So these are the final parts. And what's great about this is you can actually put this in any other figure. Take out the arms or legs on the other ones to do a mix and match. We'll do that later. So here is our final toy. It's the sixth one. You only have to buy five to get six toys and spring trap. All completed. Alright, it's time to open up our giant Play-Doh surprise egg to get to the cool toys inside. So we have plenty of Five Nights at Freddy's surprises in here, as well as some other cool characters that come from like video games and stuff. So let's see if we can peel this all back in one piece, and there we go. So we have it all in one piece. I could actually dry this out and have it, you know, and save it if I wanted to. Alright, so we'll put this off to the side, and time to peel back the purple Play-Doh. Alright, so what's first? What's the very first thing that we're going to open up here today? Now, I haven't opened up one of these yet. It's a Five Nights at Freddy's 8-Bit uh, Freddy. So you can see here, it's kind of like Legos. Sort of, I guess. It's not really like the Lego minifigures. It's more like just building characters out of the bricks. So let's go ahead and open this up. And if you collect all of them, there's actually a couple extra pieces in here so you can build like Golden Freddy. So here's our instructions and it shows, ooh, a sew stage by McFarlane Toys. So, maybe we'll get that later. Okay, so there's the instructions. Pretty easy, pretty simple. Put these together. It comes with the instructions to make all of them, but we only have the parts for Freddy in here. So here is our bag of parts, and let's go ahead and open this up and assemble it. All right, everybody, you're not going to believe it. While I was assembling Freddy, I turned off the camera. And, well, here's Freddy. He's complete, and he's holding his birthday cake. But I made a mistake when I turned off the camera. I forgot to turn it back on. Oh, no. So guess what I did? I opened up all the surprises in this episode. Oh, man. Well, I made the mistake, but... I can show you some, I can still show them off. So we had a Crossy Roads box here and we got this little penguin character. So he looks really neat. So just like that, I already pre-opened everything. I already know what I'm getting, but I'll show you what we got. So we got this blind bag of Five Nights at Freddy keychain and we got the Golden Freddy. I'm, I really like this Golden Freddy. He's got the black eyes. He's like nobody's inside there. He's just like the other Freddy, but he actually has a metal claw. And we also opened up, let's see what else. Oh, we opened up a Sonic dog tag pack. We got Sonic as the sticker and Sonic as the dog tag too. 
and we opened up our very first Minecraft Series 3 blind bag. These just came out. I bought what I could so I could show them off to you guys. I can't believe they finally made the Series 3. I'm going to have to make a Minecraft egg to show these off. And we, oh, I had the first one opened up on camera. Look at all these characters that you can get in this set. And guess what? I could, I didn't get it opened up live. I forgot to turn on the camera. So sorry about that. And we got a crafting table. It was our very first Minecraft Series 3 keychain. Now, I wanted to see if this thing opened up like a like a chest or anything like that, but it doesn't. It's just a, sort of a box with all the crafting design stuff on the sides. Okay, so I'm going to have to definitely open up, a, make a Minecraft egg to show that off. We also opened up an Assassin's Creed blind bag pack, and we got the same character that we got before, sort of in the hoodie, where he doesn't even look like an Assassin's Creed character, really. Okay, I opened up... I also opened up a Loot Crate exclusive. This is so analog from Tendo. Now, this is supposed to look like the old Nintendo cartridges, and they make it into a little action figure. So this is Aliens Attack, and you can see the eyes and stuff like that, but the best part, it comes with this Duck Hunt gun. I love it. I love that Duck Hunt gun. I used to bring me back to my childhood. <laughs> okay, so that was a really cool Loot Crate exclusive. We also opened up a keychain pack of TMNT and got my favorite Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. We got Raphael. And from a Five Nights at Freddy's dog tag pack, we got Chica. And this is like the moment right before they're going to take you, eat you or something. <laughs> and we got a My Moji. And for the My Moji, we got one of my favorite characters that I've really been liking. It's Puppet. And he looks like he's got the big smiley face emoji. But in, in the actual game, he looks a lot scarier with that smiley face. Okay, let's see. What else did we open up? Uh, we opened up another dog tag pack and from Yokai Watch, and we got the stickers, we got the tattoos, and we got here Kamajiro dog tag. Look at those eyebrows. <laughs> That's like I hear the spiky hair, but not spiky eyebrows. Okay, and then we opened up a minifigure, and we got Freddy himself. So very scary looking Freddy from the minifigure blind box. Now. I couldn't leave the episode just like that. We also did the mix and match, and I got that on camera. I forgot to get that on camera, I mean. So I did the mix and match here, and we took Bonnie's body, and we took off the arms and legs of Foxy and put them on Bonnie. So it looks like, you know, way different. But Foxy looks amazing. He actually looks like he's been working out. Look at Foxy here with Bonnie's arms and legs. He looks like he actually has muscles now. So because Everything that was inside the giant surprise egg, I didn't get caught on video or everything I opened up didn't get caught on video. We're going to open up some more stuff. So here we are. We have a few more stuff, including some exclusives like this Alien vs. Predator blind bag box from Loot Crate. It's another exclusive. And this doesn't normally fit inside my giant egg, so it's a good time to show it off, I guess. So in the set, there's a bunch of different odds to get a bunch of different characters here. And on the side of the box, you can see the alien on one side and the predator on the other. And because it's exclusive, I wonder if it's going to be an exclusive toy. Let's open it up. And it looks like we got the predator. Oh man, the predator has always been one of my favorite characters. In the movies, everything like that. Alien vs. Predator, I'm always rooting for the Predators. Now, he's his odds to get this guy is not on the back of this box. So, I'm guessing because it's a Loot Crate exclusive, this is the only way to get him. I could be wrong. But inside the box, he also comes with a spear, too. So, he's got like the gun on his shoulder and things like that. And he comes with a spear right here. So, let's go ahead and put it in his hands. And there he is, looking really cool. And we have a Me Mega Man for a mini series. So this is a mini series mini figure, I guess. And it's the Mega Man from Kid Robot. So a lot of different odds to get different characters. Hopefully we get Mega Man. So let's open up this box right here. This will be my first one I've ever opened up. Alright, that looks awesome. Our first figure from the Mega Man blind box here is going to be Mega Man. Now this is the red Mega Man. So on the box it says 1 out of 20. And uh, so he's not the rarest and he's not the most common. But 
Let's see, it looks like you can get three different Mega Mans. Blue, green, and red. Alright, so let's open up another Five Nights at Freddy toy here. We got another My Moji. And we got Freddy himself again. Now, I think this is a different My Moji than the other Freddy I get I have gotten. I have to double check, but I think the other one was like a wink. So this was more of a smile. And of course, I'm going to open up another Minecraft Hangar Series 3 blind bag here because I didn't get the first one on camera and recorded for you guys. We'll definitely have to open up another one. So let's open this up and see who we have. And from the purple body, it looks like we got the witch. I think it is. And there's the head. Yep, this is the witch. So it comes in two pieces. I guess it's too long for the blind bag. So let's go ahead and open this up and put it together. Not very many minifigures you have to put together, but I, the ones that you do are usually cooler. So we'll go ahead and push the head on here. And so the head kind of moves left and right. Let's see, what else moves on this? Oh, okay, on the witch here, the legs move. And the arms do too. So a really cool minifigure of the witch. It actually reminds me of just like an action figure. It just happens to have a keychain on it. Okay. Well, sorry about not getting the very first toys on camera. Sorry about that. But we opened up a bunch of cool... Whoa! Foxy, where'd you come from? I was talking there about all the cool toys we were opening up. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video of OMT. See you next time, and thanks for watching.